Why is there a bottle of urine in my lab? Strange. When shaken, the contents turn reddish. And if I keep shaking, the red liquid even turns green. I can safely conclude it definitely can't be urine. It's famously referred to as the traffic light bottle. To create the traffic light bottle, I require glucose and an exceptionally vivid dye called indigo carmine. The indigo carmine is the main actor in this reaction and initially turns the liquid a deep blue. The color of indigo carmine is pH dependent. Pouring it into sodium hydroxide changes it from blue to green. This color might look familiar from a traffic light. If I wait now, the bottle slowly transitions from green to red and eventually turns yellow. During the reaction, the indigo carmine is reduced by the glucose, resulting in this yellow reduced form. The red color is most likely a radical intermediate stage during this reduction process. When I shake the bottle now, the dye becomes oxidized by a slight amount of air oxygen present at the top and changes back to green again. 